Ooh, watch out, watch out, let go, let go. It's our second day, or my second day. I had a buddy of mine come out today, Juan. He came out, he wanted to ride. He's got a new mule, nice mule. <laughs> a little ga uh, gated mule. And he's got a new trailer. And uh, he wanted to come out and ride with me today. So we, uh, we didn't really get that early a start. We, no, we didn't get an early start at all. Let Sissy go over there. Now Sissy's there. I have my talent with me today, but I don't have him under contract. So I tried, I gotta keep, I can't keep him on film. I got, <laughs> he's too damn expensive. But well, good is expensive. My agreement with him is only for pack trips. It's not for lion hunting. Yeah, there's Sissy. Look at that tail. All right. That lion. See, we trailed down to there and then she she's hunting. So she came right up through this. I bet she worked her way around this edge right here. And we're probably going to have to move them unless they decide they're going to go Well, because really, I mean, if I, this is a two day old track right now. Uh-huh. But you could just trail right over there and she made a kill and then she's bedded down right on top of that hill. Mm -hmm. Oh, she says it's there, boys. You better listen to her. can't take it out of there. They get a little scent here and there. Let's just build a fire and have a cup of coffee. <laughs> and then Sheila? Yeah. They want to run it fast, but they just can't get enough scent to run it fast. Boy, they work at it hard, don't they? Oh, it's just... What's the dog's name with the, with the rough boys? That's Sheila. She, uh, Sheila? Sheila Puppy. Okay, they got it right to there. I bet she turned and went up that way, maybe, no? What's that dog's name is barking? P. P? I trailed yesterday with the male dogs most all the afternoon. Cole trailed in the morning. 
full trailed all day, but really, really slow going in the morning up that ridge. Finally got to a point where it warmed up and the dogs trailed real good, trailed down to the bottom. It got to be about, I don't know, about three or four o'clock, something like that. And they just, you know, they just stopped. They, they were still trying, but they couldn't go anywhere. So this morning I loaded up the girl dogs and, and the females and came up here and rode right back up to where we were. And they hit it and they trailed, but that, you know, there's a lot of elk sign and a lot of deer sign in there. And I think what's happened, what, that lion was in there hunting and she just, she walked those rims and walked those edges and then, you know, you'd trail real good and then when she'd go around an edge and start to top out on the other side, it would just slow down to a crawl. And I think that's because she was hunting and she would, when she'd do that, she'd just start creeping up through there. You know, just sneaking, and then she'd come over, and, and then she went down and got underneath some trees and walked around, and the dogs balled around in the circle there for every, you know, it kind of got frustrating because they just, they didn't swing out very far, you know, and look for that track where she was going, and finally I got them to swing out, you know. A lot of times when you, you know, you're just sitting there on your mule watching them, you got to get off, you know. You got to get off and start walking around yourself, and then when you start walking around, then they start looking too, you know. So, but she went all the way down, all the way through a couple canyons, and then circled all the way back down over her own track from yesterday, and then down and went out the other side of the canyon. And uh, finally, we just got down to a point. It got late. It got 2.30. I don't know. It was 2.30, 3 o'clock. The dogs were hot. It got pretty warm today, and they just quit, you know. But, and, you know, and it... And that's one of the problems. If you, I mean, if you're gonna, if you were gonna be successful hunting in this country, you have to hunt consecutive days, and you have to have enough dogs. You, you don't, you know, you don't have to hunt. I put eight dogs on the ground at a time because I like to have a lot of dogs on the ground. Because I, I always got dogs in different stages. You know, I got young dogs that aren't even opening up. I got some dogs that are trying to help a little bit, but just not really doing much. And then I got the older dogs. And, uh, but I got eight males and eight females. And so I just rotate them. And so what you need to do is to be able to have fresh dogs and be able to hunt consecutive days. So ideally, I would come back tomorrow and try to pick up where I left off with the male dogs and hopefully they could trail to wherever she was. I had an idea where she went. You know, it, it kind of lined up to a big old, like a big old chute in a, in a mountain with some rocks and some brush and some big old bluffs. Just looked like a place where she might have went. You know, I could be wrong, but I could I could bring the male dogs back tomorrow and make a big circle in there. Maybe be able to hunt them two days, spend the night up here and hunt another day. And then, you know, if you're trailing and you're moving, you're on, on the lion and she going, you know, and you haven't caught her yet, come back with another set of dogs and, and keep on going with her until she makes a kill or, or lays up somewhere or you bump her or get on the short end of the track. But we had two really good days of trailing. And, and like I was telling my buddy Juan, you know, I... I'm on a lion track and I know I'm trailing and going the right way, I'm pretty happy. You know, and we I found what looked like a couple tracks, you know, and make sure I was going the right way. So it was a good day. I don't, you know, and I don't know how far behind that lion we are. But, you know, I'm saying we might have been on a two-day-old track. I don't know. I can't, I can't tell. I can make something up, but. Yeah, so anyway, here's one right now to do the ending. If you want to see more content, subscribe. If you want to get notifications, get that click that little uh if you want to see more if you want to see more video, subscribe. And if you want notifications, click that little bell. If you want <laughs> if you <laughs> If you, oh, I gotta start from the beginning. If you like this video, subscribe. Mm -hmm. And if you, uh, 
If you want to get more subscriptions, hit the. No, if you want to get notifications. If you want to hit get notifications, I have to write this down. Baby. <laughs> <laughs> it's all right. I forget all the time. And uh, and if you like it, crash that like button. There you go. That's the main thing. <laughs> I think I'll skip the middle part just to say. You already got it. I already got it. Oh yeah. <laughs> Not wanting to get in. Ooh, watch out, watch out, let go, let go, let go, let go, let go, let go. She got this on her side. Okay. All right, girl. Yeah, she just. That's what I tell everybody. She just. She'd just be in a mule. <laughs> That's exactly right.